Good evening, everybody. I'm CJ Ward. And I'm Beth Farnsworth. The Housing Authority of Santa Barbara is in the final stages of one of its very latest housing projects. And News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti joins us live with more on that project. Patricia. Yeah. Well, you can see the housing project right behind me. And even though it's going to be finished in about a month this June, the city says there are still ways the community can support the project. Construction of this low-income housing unit is almost finished in downtown Santa Barbara. We're so excited to be opening this brand new permanent supportive housing development which is going to offer much needed supportive housing. Located on East Coda Street, the project called Veracruz Village will bring 28 apartments to the city. The Women's Fund of Santa Barbara contributed $50,000 to furnish the unit. Our members voted to fund this project mainly because we see homelessness and the lack of affordable housing as a critical need in our community. And we're excited about it because it's going to bring needed housing to Santa Barbara. As construction nears completion, there are still ways the community can help support this project. To be able to purchase some of the remaining items such as bedding and towels and uh, dinnerware, kitchenware, things like that. The goal of the property is to help those at risk of homelessness, including seniors, secure affordable housing. Developers hope those who move in will be able to get themselves back on their feet. The units can then be used again for others in need. We're so excited to be opening Veracruz Village this summer. It is going to meet a very critical need within our community for more affordable housing. Clearly, we know that this community needs more housing for our unsheltered people, and so this is just the beginning. This housing unit will be open in June, and if you'd like to help support the project, log on to our website or mobile app. For now, live in Santa Barbara, I'm News Channel reporter Patricia Marlotti. Let's send it back to you in the studio.